Welcome to this NMP flight video tutorial. This tutorial will look at the validation of a new flight plan, which includes the assessment of the ATFCM delay, as well as filing to IFPS. To start with, you have to go to the free text editor. Once you're in the editor, you have to paste your flight plan into the editor window and there you have the options to validate and file to IFPS as well as the proposed route. So in this case I will click on the validate option and what I receive is the validation of IFPS which shows valid it shows that it's caught in two measures which are plotted on the map with the flight and it gives me the EOBT validity if I file that flight plan as well as the assessment of the ATFCM delay which here shows a CTOT of 2010 that is a delay of 16 minutes. I also have the option to click on the hyperlink to open the RAD homepage if I have an issue with my route and I want to go and have a look at the RAD and also I can propose routes to give me alternative routes even if my flight plan is valid that can be useful to see if the alternative routes are a little bit more cost efficient than the one that I have used or if my route is invalid it will show me some possible valid routes. The propose routes functionality is the subject of another video tutorial. Once I am happy with my flight plan I can copy it and take it to my flight planning system or I can file it directly to IFPS by clicking on the button. Once I click on it, I have to confirm. I will confirm yes. And then I get the ACK message shown on my screen with also a hyperlink that will open a new tab showing the flight in the ETFMS system. If I click on that, a new tab opens, doing a flight list query on that flight and showing it in the ETFMS system. That's all for this tutorial. Thanks for watching.